And let's not forget that there are other ways of educating yourself than being on the mat. Sure. And being on the mat is probably the most important one, but you most definitely can educate yourself off the mat, and that should count for something, right? But many of us don't even do that, right? Sitting in front of TV and watching Netflix is not educating yourself, right? Or watching a jujitsu well, movie. Jiu -jitsu. Well, yeah, watching jujitsu movie is not. You're not going to learn anything from John Wick. <laughs> John Wick is not teaching you jujitsu, right? But, you know, maybe perhaps spending 15 minutes, and I'm not kidding you, 15, 1, 5, watching a constructive jujitsu instructional could really bring you benefit. And I don't mean scrolling Instagram. I mean actually watching and educating yourself. All that is part of your education. All that is part of your success. You know, but again, hyper focusing on the work, not on the end result, is definitely going to change the dynamic how fast and how strong you are progressing in your jiu-jitsu journey. And this is not only applicable to jiu-jitsu, right? Whether you play checkers, skydiving, or doing whatever woodwork, whatever other skills that you're trying to learn is going to be the same thing. Playing a guitar, mm -hmm. or playing a piano is the same thing. is is a consistency. Yeah. This is not jujitsu related. This is education one on one. Consistency of inquiring the knowledge and then cataloging it so you can recall it at the right time.